we're walking along the ridge on the way to get as near to this mountain as we can possibly and it's so 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 cold but like I said it's spectacular Good morning from Otisei. So today's our last morning in Dolomites and we are heading to do the Cicada hike. So it's kind of easier because we just need to walk from our hotel to the cable car station, take the cable car up and just walk around. So let's go. It's an easy walk from town because they have a ski escalators that leads from the center to the cable car station. So we got our tickets, which is 32 euros for our return. And yes, a little pricey, but it is a cable car. So let's go. Remember to scan the code and keep your ticket for your return journey. Since we got there early, we had a whole cable car to ourselves. We are waiting at the change of the cable car, so that we just went up from the town, obviously, and now we had families changing up to go to Cicada. The second part of the journey is much steeper. Without taking the cable car at all, it would take us three hours to hike up from town. We made it to the viewpoint. Oh, look at this. It's so, so pretty. So now we're going to take a little hike around. I just flew my drone, yep. so here are some shots. Cicada is famous for the rugged shape of the mountains and you can hike up quite close to it but I'll be very careful because it is a steep drop. We have reached the end of this path because the mountain is just behind us. You can uh, actually go further up but really not that necessary if you don't have a tire or if it's too cold. So we're just going to turn back and get the cable car. We took a parallel route that is not on the edge of the mountain to go back to the cable car station and made our way back down. All in all, a very great stop on our last day of Dolomite trip before we drive back to Venice. <laughs>